Hello, Adam. Uh, thanks for reaching out. I love your questions. You want to know what the sets were like on the movie Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Well, uh, we had a lot of different sets. We had a sound stage, and um, that's where we had uh, the school, uh, some of the, like, where we shot the prom scenes. And um, let's see, uh, Buffy's, the inside of Buffy's home, we had that there. Um, we had, uh, gosh, I think uh, Lotho's, chambers were there and uh, we had a lot of different sets um, on the sound stage and then we actually shot at a high school and um, we also shot in the graveyard of the Rose Bowl where they keep all of the parade floats in Pasadena and that was pretty neat and then Griffith Park we made our own cemetery there when Buffy uh, had her fight out there, or she was out there with Merrick, and um, and uh, and the vampires came out of the graves. So, uh, lots of great sets, and uh, I think you wanted to know what my favorite scene in the movie is. Gosh, I don't know if I have a favorite scene. Uh, there's a lot of them that are really good and fun, and I enjoyed doing the entire movie. So. Um, I guess, I mean, it's a classic, you know, Paul Rubin's uh, dying and coming back to life and dying and coming back to life is one of the funniest moments. And um, let's see, did, do I think Buffy needed the help of a black and tan Jack Russell named Roxy to help take down the vampires? I am guessing, Adam, that that is your pup. And I'm going to say... Yes, uh, Buffy would have welcomed Roxy to come out and help. So thanks for reaching out, Adam. Take care and Happy New Year.